Thomas shows Connor the will Mr. Barry made, which states that he will inherit Mr. Barry's vast fortune, but only if he marries Freya Phillips, a woman he doesn't know. Otherwise, the entire mm. estate will be donated to a charitable foundation. Connor was stunned and asked who Freya Phillips was, not realizing that a wife was attached to the inheritance of the will. Thomas regrets that according to the will, he cannot reveal anything about her. Eager to escape poverty, Connor agrees despite his concerns about Freya's physical appearance. And who would turn down a hefty inheritance? After signing the will, he was handed a prestigious debit card tied to his new company, worth over $10 trillion. Thomas respectfully handed the card to Connor, indicating that he was running the company for Connor. If there was any trouble, feel free to call him. When he left the office and took the elevator downstairs, he was surrounded by security. This was because he had inadvertently bumped into a woman, Miss Moore, before going upstairs. She joined the receptionist in accusing him of moles. Connor said he did accidentally bump into Miss Moore earlier and admitted his mistake and apologized. The black stocking lady looked at Connor with contempt and demanded huh. that he kneel and kowtow to her or else she would turn Connor over to the police. As Connor was surrounded by guards, he looked helpless. He did not expect the lady to make such an unreasonable demand. Connor turned his head to look at the security chief, but he said nothing. Just because he was poor didn't mean he didn't have dignity. Just then, an angry voice came from behind Connor. What are you all doing here, Scarlet? 